Hey everybody, it's Allison and Harper and Monday. <laughs> and what are we doing? We're going to get our grocery haul. We're going to go pick up some groceries and we thought we would share what we got. Alright, we just made it home. We're going to go unpack everything and show you what we got. All right, so we are gonna start up here with the vegetables. You guys know that I love to buy everything organic that I can, but that is not always an option. So we'll start with the lettuce. I like to get a variety of lettuces, sometimes iceberg. This is red lettuce. And then we have some butter lettuce. Butter lettuce is one of our absolute favorites, but I like to mix them. I don't use a lot of iceberg lettuce because there's really no nutritional value in it whatsoever. Um, it's just kind of a filler, so I always try to buy these types of lettuces and some spinach, if possible. We got some mini cukes. Um, our garden is pretty much done. We don't have any lettuce. We don't have any cucumber left, so I did have to buy some mini cucumbers. And I like these mini English cucumbers just because then, like this one cucumber is great for like kids' lunches, when probably one or two cucumbers is great for a, um, a whole family of four salad so you're not wasting a huge big cucumber or needing to preserve it in anything in the fridge it's just cut up a couple of these minis and you're good to go so then I got a package of whole white mushrooms then I got a package of organic celery I got um, a package of asparagus I got four broccoli crowns now broccoli is something that I often do not buy organic because broccoli because broccoli is notorious for being really buggy so um, I don't normally tend to buy iceberg lettuce as organic or broccoli crowns just because I don't really like the bugs that are so readily all through them <laughs> I got two bags of red potatoes these are organic and these are uh, one and a half pound bags two of those so I got two bags two five pound bags of russet potatoes um, I did request these to be organic there were a few other things I requested as organic like the cucumbers here but these were my substitutions I also requested organic tomatoes because our tomatoes are pretty much done at this point and I just got some regular tomatoes which is okay it's fresh as better than nothing then I got six ears of corn now moving into the fruits and vegetables I was pretty happy with the organic quality here um, I got two packages these are six ounce packages of organic raspberries two 32 ounce packages of organic strawberries and then I got two organic 32 ounce packages one of green grapes and one of red grapes these are both seedless then I requested organic bananas but they sent me regular bananas um, it's okay but I prefer the organic so I got two bundles of bananas then I got three bags these are three pound bags of gala apples so I got three of those and I also got a bag of clementines those are great for in kids lunches say hi Harper hi so we got all of our fruits and veggies done and then I'm just gonna work in this back row here we love this Martin's brand bread potato bread this is like our favorite it's not the best for you but it is so delicious we got three loaves of that and then we also got 12 sliced sliders these are like a small hamburger bun these are great for the kids for their lunches because the sandwiches aren't enormous they're very kid friendly and we got a package of Thomas's blueberry bagels in the back we got two boxes of Ritz crackers these are like the um, fresh stacks there's an eight count 
in each box. They are also good for in the kids' lunches. We like to do snacky lunches, so I'll send some pepperoni, Ritz crackers, some cheese slices, and they'll have a little bit of a snacky type lunch. Brian requested these little bags of chips for in his lunch at work. Um, he likes the convenience and the variety. Moving into the other snacks, I decided to try this brand of Pipcorn. I love Pipcorn snacks. So we got real cheddar cheese balls and we got real cheddar crunchies. So these are like Cheetos and then these are like cheese balls. Um, but they're supposed to be better for you. They're not organic, but they are baked and they're made with real cheddar cheese and they have less fat than normal um, cheese balls and Cheeto crunchies. So we'll try those and let you know how they go. Then we just got three bags of chips. These Lay's chips were on sale for $1.99 a bag if you bought two. So I got a bag of Lay's barbecue and a bag of Lay's sour cream and onion. And then we're always a big fan of um, just regular potato chips. I decided to try this Cape Cod brand. Um, they have 40% less fat and they are with original sea salt. Then we also got some jelly. Brian has been really loving taking sandwiches to work with him. So we got a 32 ounce jar of Concord grape jelly. And then I got, that's like a, not a very normal thing. We don't eat a lot of grape jelly in this house unless it's homemade. We've been very spoiled in that avenue, but I figured I'd give it a try. Um, Martin's didn't really have a huge selection in jelly, but this is what we got. We also got two 16 ounce jars, 18 ounce, sorry, of um, strawberry jelly. I got a box package of just Bic lighters. And we got a 12 count box of Cliff Z bars. These are organic. I like to take these in my work bag. Um, it's just a great organic snack that if you're feeling like you need a little pick-me-up or you're having a little chocolate craving. These are really, really good. They're like a fudgy chocolate brownie. These are my favorite flavor of Z-Bars. And, and they're organic. And they're organic. And I also got three boxes of these cereal bars. I got all three as the strawberry flavor. There are six bars in each box, and they are organic as well. The verdict is going to be out on how they taste. London has already broken into one box to try it. <laughs> then last but not least, back here we have some juice. We have two gallons of Ocean Spray Crayon Grape Juice. And then we have two, um, these are 64, they're two quart, half a gallon, two half gallons of 100% apple juice and two half gallons of Honeycrisp style apple juice. So there you have it. That is our grocery haul. This will probably last us, um, I would say about two weeks is the goal. And I spent, I had a $30 off coupon and I spent approximately $227 for all of this. All right, everybody, I hope you have enjoyed this Martin's Grocery Haul. We will see you next time. Bye.